This is Peak Equivalence Reflexivity Objects 2B. And for this program, we used various materials that we had around, and you just need two that are identical for each set. So yellow crayon sticks we did, popsicle sticks, rhino stickers, noodles, and again, you would just need two of each. You're gonna run train A to B and test B to A the exact same way where the client or person is gonna get asked two questions and they need to get them both correct to get a 10. You're gonna vary your yes or no answers for these, but you're always gonna use whatever, if it's stimuli A for train or your stimuli B for test to show that item first. So I'll kind of just show you a couple examples of what this one might look like. So I'm gonna kind of back up for a second. So if I'm running for train for, you know, the yellow crayon, I'm going to ask again the two questions. So the first item I'm going to show is the yellow crayon and then the comparison. Are those the same? They would say yes. Then I'm going to show the yellow crayon again first and then maybe show the noodle. Are those the same? And then if I did for the popsicle sticks, I would maybe do, look at this, look at this. Are those the same? Look at this. Look at this, are those the same? And hopefully they would have answered correctly for both questions. If let's say you did, you know, look at this, look at this, are these the same? And they say yes, you might show it a second time. Look at this, look at this, is that the same? If they answer incorrect again, you might show them side by side to the client and say, look, are these the same? And then prompt from there. So for, let's say the rhino, you would say, look at this, Look at this, are those the same? Yes. Look at this. Look at this, are those the same? No. So those two questions are one trial. So you're actually gonna be asking two questions per trial, 10 times for train, and again, asking both questions for every trial and test for those 10 trials as well. So that's just kind of a quick sample of what peak equivalence reflexivity objects to be might look like.